I'm turning heads on the scene They can't help but know my name It's boring, it's boring, it's boring They know I like the finer things Make up jewelry, diamond rings It's boring, it's boring, it's boring going to be my what's in my purse and the purse that I have been carrying for the past few months is my Louis Vuitton artsy and it just looks like this it's pretty big and I do stuff it um a lot probably more than I should because I shouldn't be putting this much weight in it but pretty much everything in here is stuff that I carry on the daily maybe besides a couple things that I probably could get taken out and you know not have in my purse all the time but actually this is good that I'm doing this because I do need to kind of empty out my bag but okay so my bag here is the artsy and it's in the monogram and it's the size mm yeah it's the mm and as you guys can tell that the leather has begin its patina process so it's starting to get a little darker than when I purchased it is like it's literally so beautiful I can't wait for it to get dark I know it's like really worn looking once it's like really really dark but I personally really like that look of like the really dark chocolate patina right now it's still light which I still really like it but I'm I'm excited for my baby to be a little bit darker so yeah so I did name my purse if you guys didn't already know um, her, in this little piece right here, I actually named her Mocha, and my wallet, which I'll go ahead and show you guys the first thing in my purse, I named my wallet Nutella. So yeah, I kind of went with the chocolate theme, just because, you know, it's like a chocolate color, and I just decided to pick those names, but yes, I absolutely love this wallet. This is the Organizer Insulate. It's the best wallet ever. I literally am obsessed with it. Um, I have all my information in here, so I'm not going to open it up, but I did get some requests to do a kind of review of the wallet, so I probably will do that in the next couple weeks, but yes, yeah, so this is my wallet, and then I also got the chain that attaches to the D-ring to go with it because it just needed to be complete. So yeah, I always keep the wallet in my purse. I also always keep my phone in my purse if I'm not like using it at the moment. I always misplace my phone and I never can find it. So if I keep it in my purse when it's not in use, then I know it's always in my purse. I just have the Samsung Galaxy S5. I do really like it, but I do want to go back to iPhone because um, I recently got a new iPad and I just want everything to kind of be synced together with my MacBook and my iPad and my phone. It just, it's better, especially because I've been buying like a lot of music on iTunes lately and I can't access that on my phone because not Apple. So I do want to get an iPhone 6 Plus. So hopefully that will happen soon, even though I don't have an upgrade anytime near the future. Like literally I have like another year and a half with this stupid phone, but I think I'm just going to like... Um, I don't know. I'll probably get like a new line or something. I don't know. We'll see. But I do want to get a new phone. So, yeah. So, the inside of the bag just looks like this. I have a lot of junk in there that probably shouldn't be in here. So, let's see. Oh, okay. So, the first thing I have in there is my iPad. I always, always, always carry my iPad with me everywhere. I just have to have my iPad. Um, I do have data plan on here so when I'm on the go in the car if I need to pull up something online well not while I'm driving but like you know what I mean like if I'm not home and there's no Wi-Fi I can use it on my iPad it's so easy to check emails and just respond to like different things and social media it's just so much easier to see it in like a really big screen because I'm so blind and I hate like little itty bitty like screens I need it to be really big so yeah I just I'm obsessed like I just love my iPad this is the iPad Air 2 so yeah and it's the gold one which I love and I got a gold case to match it so yeah that's in there the next thing I have is a receipt what is this oh okay so this is from Old Navy got some $20 extra whatever super cash so, oh yeah, this is when I went and I bought some clothes for school. 
So I bought some like basic black tees and different stuff like that because I'm going to be starting beauty school soon. So I needed to stock up on black clothing for my wardrobe. So yeah, if you guys want to see like a, I don't know, I think it's kind of boring because it's everything is literally all black. But if you guys want to see what I got to wear to school, to cosmetology school, let me know in the comments. So I have two little notebooks. The first one is a like um, planner. So it's like from August, no, July to June. So I'm going to need a new one of these because it's about to be the end of May. So now we're going into June and then I'll need a new one. And then I just have a random like pink little um, striped notebook with a pink gel pen, which I'm obsessed with. I love gel pens. But yeah, I just use this to jot down notes real quick or if I have an idea or something I need to do, like a to-do list, grocery shopping list, I can just write it out because it's just literally lined paper and it's small, convenient, and I like it. So yeah, and then I have one more notebook and this is my calendar. So it's kind of weird because it's like a big calendar, but it's small, you know, at the same time, but it's big for a purse. So we're in May. So yeah, so this is like just like, I like it because it doesn't have like little sections day by day. It's literally just like a calendar. So every page is every month. So that's all this is. It's just the monthly calendar. But I like it because it's nice and pink and pretty and I can write down schedules of like my work and what I have to do. Just different things like that. So the next thing in my purse is my Beats and I love these headphones like I always like heard about Beats and you know people have them and all this stuff and I was like I'm not spending that kind of money on some headphones like that's just not gonna happen but I'm telling you like this puts music on a whole nother level. I'm obsessed. I love them. I use them all the time when I go to the gym. I always take them with me. These are the Solo 2 in the white. I wanted to get the wireless ones, but those were like $100 more, and I was like, not right now. I'm just going to see how I like them first, make sure I actually like use them and stuff, because I do that a lot where I'll spend money on something, and then I don't really use it. I kind of forget about it, and then I just like waste the money. Kind of like my Fitbit. Oh my god, I need to start using my Fitbit again. But yes, yeah, so I had purchased a Fitbit. I was all into it like for like two months straight I was like logging every day I was counting my steps and all this stuff and then out of nowhere I just stopped using it I forgot about it then I lost the charger and stuff like that happens to me all the time so yeah I want to make sure that wasn't gonna happen with these so I'm probably gonna sell these on my account one of my little closet things but if not I'll give them to my sister, but I do want to get the wireless pair, so I might sell these and get the wireless pair. I don't know. We'll see, but I'm loving those beats. Like, literally, I take them everywhere with me because when I'm in the car with my family, like, if we go to, like, you know, Sunday lunch or something like that, they like to play their ratchet music. Not really ratchet, but, like, stuff that I don't really care for to hear. So, I'm like, no, I can't listen to this. So, then I just put on mine, and I listen to my own music, and it's a lot better. So here I just have a receipt to TJ Maxx. What did I buy? Oh, I just, when I went with my mom and I bought her a suitcase because she's going to be going on vacation. And my grandma was in town a few weeks ago and she came like on a short notice. Like literally she just came. So she didn't really bring a suitcase. And um, she left with a bunch of stuff that we had bought her. So we gave her my mom's suitcase so then I just bought my mom a new suitcase so she could have a suitcase again because we gave the suitcase to my grandma so yeah so the next thing I have is two pairs of sunglasses which sounds kind of stupid like why do I carry two pairs of sunglasses with me but I just I just do because depending on what I'm wearing like these are my Ray-Bans and they're just gold so I like them when I'm wearing like something that matches like gold jewelry or something so I'm not exactly sure which style these are but they're just the regular aviator Ray-Bans in the gold so yeah so I have those 
in the little pouch and then I also have my babies oh my gosh I love these like literally you guys are gonna think I'm crazy but what I did to like get these sunglasses was crazy um I saw these sunglasses on cookie in the episode I'm not exactly sure but she was coming in this is on Empire by the way so it was the episode where she's walking into like the Empire building or whatever where they have like all their offices and the meetings and she was wearing these sunglasses and I was like okay I need those in my life like I literally am obsessed so I googled the episode and I googled cookie and I googled sunglasses and the glasses came up and I was so happy because like you can't really see them like you can kind of see them as she's walking like you see this part but like you couldn't see like the rest of the sunglasses so I was like I don't know what kind of sunglasses those are but then when I found out that they were by Prada and I was like oh my gosh I need those like I love these sunglasses so much they're so cute they look so so good on like when you wear them and you're in the light like you can just see how the rhinestones like hit the light and it's just so so nice they were pretty pricey I'm not gonna lie but I mean it's like totally worth it for me because they're so classy and I feel like these will never go out of style and if they do I'm still gonna rock them because they're me in a sunglass like I love them the rhinestones the little um design on the side and they're black they match anything so I'm just obsessed with these Prada babies I love them so yeah and I just keep them in this little case they come with a big white case but it's too bulky and it just takes up too much room but yeah these are my little babies and oh my god I love them so much so I keep those in my purse and then I keep some random loose things like another receipt from Target okay I bought some sunscreen for Ashlyn and what else another receipt from Target what did I buy okay I bought some travel items for my trip to Mexico and I have another receipt I have too many receipts I have a receipt for Brewster's because me and Ashlyn love ice cream and we always go to Brewster's and get some ice cream so yeah and then I have this little thingy which is just like a little business card type of holder but I keep like my store card so like my Sephora VIB card my Panera card my Express Next card like all the like store rewards where you can get points I keep them in here and then I have some like coupons also in there and then I have another little like wallet folder thingy from Target I love this thing it says as good as gold and it's just so so cute so I just keep like gift cards in here because I just like to like separate my items and keep them organized and I have a Brewster's secret award card well sweet reward card this is not Victoria's Secret so I'm gonna go ahead and put that away because I can do that so I don't keep getting messy and then I have a little Victoria's Secret makeup bag even though I don't really keep makeup in here I mean I kind of do I guess I don't know I just keep like random things like I keep this brow pencil by Maybelline which I'm really really liking and I keep my favorite lippy at the moment which is the Too Faced Melted Sugar I keep Vaseline Lip Therapy Cocoa Butter and a second one of those which probably should be tossed because it's empty. I keep some Visine for contacts because I do wear contacts and my eyes can get a little dry sometimes so yeah. Oh my gosh I have a third. You can tell I'm so obsessed with these because I have three of these little Vaseline things and I didn't even know I had three in there. That's the problem. Okay so then I have a extra hair tie in case I want to throw my hair up and I have a mini deodorant which is always handy especially right now because it's super hot outside and I keep a mini little spoolie so yeah I don't know why that's in there but yeah so that's pretty much it I do have a little bit of extra loose makeup in my purse this is the NARS Turkish Delight Lip Gloss which I love 
and the gimme brow by benefit which is also another like holy grail item for my eyebrows when i'm on the go like literally i'm in the car and i can like do my eyebrows rushing on the way to wherever i'm going if i'm not wearing makeup that's all i use is that gimme brow stuff it's bomb and let's see anything in the little pockets okay so then i have are you kidding me oh my gosh i have another <laughs> I have another Vaseline lip thingy. What is wrong with me? I'm obsessed with those, but I didn't know, like, I had four of those in my purse. Okay, so then I have this Tony Moly Lip Balm in Honey, which is awesome. I love that. It's so, so cute. Like, when you're out and you're, like, putting it on your lips, it's like, you just look so glamorous. And then I have some pills which should go back in my medicine cabinet. It's just some Tylenol. I was sick and I had like a fever and a headache, so I was taking some Tylenol, but that needs to go back in my medicine cabinet. And then I have some clean and clear absorbing sheets, which I love because it is hot and I get oily and it's not cute, so it's nice to have those in the purse. And then what else I have? Barely nothing left in here. I have a tweezer, which I love. This is my new one. It's by Revlon. I just really like it because it's gold, and I love gold. And then I have some little headphones. I keep these in my purse in case uh, me and Ashlyn are both somewhere. We both want to listen to music, and she usually is the one to take my beats because she likes my beats, and I'll just stick with these because, yeah. I'm a good mommy. I let her use my beats. And then I have some, some, I have a mirror from Hello Kitty, which I love it. It's so, so cute. I got it at Sephora. And even though it does feel really like cheap, like plastic, like it feels like one of those like play Barbie mirrors, but I just like it because it's cute and it's, you know, rhinestones, Hello Kitty. I love Hello Kitty. Even now I still love Hello Kitty and I'm like 21 years old. Okay, so I have a little purse hanger thing. So one of these things, I love them. They're so handy. You go out to a restaurant and you don't want to sit your purse like on the floor or there's not like an extra chair to sit your purse in. You literally hook this part on the table. So let's say this is the table. You can do it like that. And then you can hook your purse on there. It's amazing. And I'm telling you, this thing is so heavy duty like I've used it so many times and still to this day I, it has not dropped my purse like it literally just like attaches like glue and it just holds it so nicely I love that thing it's amazing I need to get another one because if that one breaks or something happens to it I'm gonna cry and it was so cute I love it because look it's a big rhinestone adorable and then I think this is the last thing in my purse it is my little camera. This one is the Samsung NX Mini. Hey. So. But yeah, it's just a white little camera. This is what I use to vlog. I usually always keep it in my purse just in case because I never know if I'm going to like vlog out of nowhere, you know. But yeah, so that is it. That's all I have in my purse. It's completely empty now. I mean, I don't really keep that much junk in my purse. It just seems like a lot because this purse is a heavy, really heavy purse. But, oh, and in here I just keep coins and a couple dollars in case I want to, like, go to a vending machine or something. But, yes, I love, 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 love my purse. Like, I'm so thankful for it. Um, I just, like, literally, it's just a beautiful bag. And I love it. And I'm going to always use it until it like falls apart on me but hopefully that will never happen because it was really really expensive and I don't want it to fall apart so yeah that's just it that is pretty much everything that I keep in my artsy my little brownie bag I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you have any more requests of any videos you guys want to see let me know in the comments because if you guys didn't notice, I've been doing really, really good filming lots of videos. I'm going to be in Cancun, so I plan on doing like an outfit of the week maybe. Some sort of, 
I don't know, beach themed video. We'll see when I get there. Last year I went and that was my plan, but the weather was so bad. It rained and stormed every single day, so I didn't get a chance to film anything. But hopefully this year they'll have nice weather and I'll be able to get a tan because super pale. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!